The Budget Committee has to have its first hearing at least 25 days before a traditional town meeting or on or before it's the third Tuesday in January. Mm -hmm. So this is RSA chapter colon 13. Um, so 4013 specifies the timetable for actions by uh, Budget Committee and SB2 Town. It has to be held by the official Budget Committee and has to be at least seven days notice before that public hearing uh, for it to be a valid public hearing. Mm -hmm. All purposes of appropriation must be discussed or disclosed at the public hearing. So if the Budget Committee receives a last minute request from the Select Board at the public hearing, as long as it's discussed and disclosed at that public hearing, that can be a legal appropriation. Um, uh, budget Committee and the Governing Body cannot take, can take the suggestions or they can say, no, we're not going to take up that proposal. But you can get new purposes and additional amounts may be brought, at, brought up at the public hearing. After the close of the public hearing, no new purpose or amount can be added by the Budget Committee or the Governing Body without another hearing. Now that theoretically could occur if you had enough time before your deliberative session to squeeze in another public hearing, and I've seen towns do it. Uh, at the last second, if you have enough time before your deliberative session, depending upon when your deliberative session is scheduled, because you've got that floating date, first Saturday in January, second, whatever it is, uh, you might be able to squeeze in the time for the seven-day notice for public, a public hearing. You can't have any increased amounts or no new subject, new subject matter. So important to emphasize, once the public hearing is closed and you're not holding another public hearing, you can't add increased amounts to the budget and you can't add new subject matter. It's fixed, set. Um, appropriations um, that you have uh, uh, for the budget also apply to petition warrant article. That is, public hearings apply to petition warrant article. So if there's a petition warrant article to raise an appropriate public dollars, that has to have a public hearing. Um, you can have at least one hearing after the petition deadline. Schedule at least one hearing after the petition article deadline. So there's a petition article deadline in the statute, which I believe is in an SB2 town. It's the first mm -hmm. or second Monday in January. And so it's probably a good idea, and again, you can look at our calendars to try to schedule your public hearing, not necessarily in the last day, but at least uh, uh, with enough time so that you know that all the possible petition warrant articles have been received, that you hold it after the deadline for the petition warrant article period has gone by. Um, and the, the Budget Committee uh, holds, finalizes the budget after the close of the public hearing and at the public meeting.